Hello children, welcome back to your maths class. Today we will be continuing percentage. Here, finding the percentage as a number. First, we are going to find out the 25% of rupees 300. That means how much exactly is the 25% in 300 rupees, right? Things that we have 25% the exact calculate 25% when we write percentage symbol as we said before in the previous class, this means divided by 100. So we will write, we will be removing percentage symbol. Percentage symbol I ahian divided by 100. Atensu percent means out of 100. Can titoka. Out of 100 and it's 125 divided by 100. Of ayahyan, instead of of, we will be putting multiplication symbol and then followed by rupees 300. Then we reduce. Two zeros, two zeros are reduced. So what do we get? 25 multiplied by 3. Do not forget to write the units here the unit is rupees so we will be writing rupees symbol here 25 multiplied by 3 means 75 this means in 300 rupees the 25 percent value is 75 rupees right then you will write the answer at the end rupees 75 next we have 10% of 75 centimeters. In 75 centimeters, how much exactly is the 10%? Here, 10% means 10 by 100. Instead of off, we put multiplication, then 75 centimeter. Then we reduce again. 0 and 0 5 can reduce 5 2 times 5 1 5 then 2 and 15 cannot be reduced anymore so 15 by 2 centimeter right so when numerator and denominator cannot be divided fully then we need to express our answer in either in decimal or in mixed fraction 15 by 2 when we divide 15 by 2, we get 7.5 centimeter, or you can write 7, 1 by 2 centimeter. When we divide it, when 15 is divided by 2, we get 7, 15, 1, right? Point, that one, point, then add 0, 5. 10, 2 plus 1, 7.5 or point dialog one, mixed fraction I convert to 1, it would be 7, 1 by 2 centimeters. Both both are correct, right? Then number 3, 50% of one day, right? In brackets, we have in eyes, a dark car zone in Kanda, don't you want? 50% means 50 out of 100. Instead of off, we write multiply. So one day when we convert it into hours, how many hours we, we, do we have in one day? 24 hours. So we write, instead of one day, we will write 24 hours. Right. Then we reduce again with the same method. 0 and 0, 5, 1, 5, 2, 2, 1, 2, 1, 2. So what do we get? 12 hours. Right. Do not forget to write the units at the end. Next, we have 15% of 1 hour. In brackets, we have, we, have, uh, we have in minutes. That means we need to calculate in minutes. 15% means 15 out of 100. Of multiply 1 hour in minutes. How many minutes we do we have in one hour? 60 minutes. So we write 60 minutes. Then we reduce again. 0 and 0 cancel. 5, 3, 5, 2. Then 2 and 6 can still be reduced. 2, 1, 
do three. So what do we get? Three into three, nine. Nine minutes. This means 15% of one hour in terms of minutes, that's nine minutes, right? For your assignment number 32, exercise 7.3 from your Galaxy textbook, question number 2, A, B, C, and D. You need to submit this assignment. Thank you.